Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Today, we're going to learn description of people or things. See the topic: intensive reading and listening. Um, the topic for today is the description of the people. You know, in our daily lives, we'll meet different people and different things. For example, me. I'm your new English teacher, so you may describe me to your parents or your friends, like my hairstyle, and my face, and my T-shirts, anything else, right? But how can you describe me to your friends? That's what we'll learn today: description of people. So the first thing for you to do is to know different colors. So let me show you some colors. And do you know the colors here? I think you know this one, right? And next one. So I want you to open up your book and turn to page, this page. I mean, and to see the different colors here. Okay, everyone, please show me your book, the student book, and turn to page 44, and you will see vocabulary here. Page 44. Now I'll give you some time to read by yourself. Come on, read the different colors here. You have got 30 seconds. But I only give you five seconds. Come on, read the colors. Okay, have finished. Let's test you. And how about this one? What color is it? Sorry, what? Oh, yeah, purple. And how about this one? Ah,、uh, blue. Yeah, it's blue. And this one, yellow. Yellow. Red, black, perfect. So let's read them again, and remember the different colors here because they will be very useful for you to describe people here. So we start from number one. Okay, here, white, white. Open your mouth widely. White, w w w, white. And next one, black, loud, black, black. And this one, brown, brown. Pink, pink, beige, beige, beige. Okay, look in my mouth. Beige, yeah, like this. Beige, beige. And next one, yellow, yellow. Beige and yellow, we often use them. Yellow is dark, but beige is light. See, so beige, we call it Chinese. 中文就是淡黄色或者是米黄色。而 yellow 就是我们说的深黄色，就是黄色的意思。So they often appear together， 所以他们俩在一起 ，right？ Beige， yellow， and next one， gray， gray， red， red， green， green， purple， purple， blue， blue， the last one， orange， orange。I know some of them are very easy for you， but you must pay attention to the pronunciation。So let's read them again。Open your book. Let's read them again from number one. White, white, black, black, brown, brown, pink, pink, gray, like this, gray, red, eh, eh. Look at my mouth, eh, red, red, green, green. Your tongue, n,、mm, green, purple. Er, purple, purple, beige, beige, yellow, yellow, blue, 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 and last one, orange, orange. Okay, so let's listen and repeat. I told you how to pronounce. You look at my mouth, and you learn to pronounce, and then listen and repeat. Okay, so let's play the record for you. And you listen it, and read it again. Ready? Unit six, exercise five A. Listen and repeat. White, black, brown, pink, gray, red, green.
Okay, so that's easy for you, right? So first, if you want to pronounce very, very, very beautiful, pure, pure pronunciation, first you need to learn how to pronounce by your mouth and then listen and imitate. Okay, 正好正确的发音呢，应该先是学习它的口型以及发音的部位，不是光听去模仿，不然你可能只听到了百分之五十的匹配度。Okay, so let's read them again last time. Different colors, very easy. No, no, number one, white, black. Brown, pink, beige, yellow, gray, red, green, purple, blue, orange. So we learn different colors because they are very important for us to describe things and people. For example, me, I want you to describe the colors on my body. Okay, so let's start from my hair. Can you tell me the color of my hair? The color of my hair, yes, black. But sometimes, British people will say hair, black hair. Sometimes dark hair, dark hair is also okay. And how about my 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 face? What color is my skin? My skin. We are Asians, so we have uh, yellow skins, right? And how about my my teeth? Teeth. The color of my teeth, not yellow, right? It's white. Uh, how about my my shirt? Shirt. The color of my shirt. Wait. Yes. It's gray. Gray. And how about the logo? The logo. Levi's. Logo here is red. Red. And how about my glasses? My glasses. My、well, glasses are black too. And my eyes. My eyes. Black. Right. If I have blue eyes. I'm a cat. Okay, good. So we need colors to describe people, describe a lot of things. For example, we're Asians, so we have the black hair, black eye, and yellow skin. And today I'm wearing a gray shirt, and the logo is red. So you may work with your partner or your parent to describe your parents' clothes or things around you. That's different colors. OK， 生活当中我们会用 N 多不同的颜色来表达不同的人物和事物。比如说，刚刚楚老师就是有黑色头发，我刚用英文解释，再来解释一遍，怕同学听不懂。那么 ，black hair 这个词是我们中国人第一个印象，说黑头发，我们第一反应是 black hair， 但其实老外，尤其英国人，会把黑发说成 dark hair。And how about 像老师有几根白发，白发怎么说 ？See， I heard some students say white hair. Sorry， it's not white hair. But we say gray hair, gray hair. Yes, remember that.、Um, in English, we never say white hair, but gray hair. 英文当中白发不说 white hair， 而说成 gray hair. Remember that. Okay. So let's move to the next part. If we know how to describe the colors, and then let's see how to describe things in your classroom or in your home. So let's see them. Okay. I want you to find some things around you now. Come on, come on, come on! Find some things around you now. Okay, ready? I want you to describe them for me. 请各位同学现在找出你身边的任何随机的东西。Don't move, 不要动，就随手拿起你身边的东西。可以拿起你的爸爸，拿起你的妈妈都可以。Okay, I want you to describe it. 请你描述一下啊。For example, I'll find something here. Wow, so many things around me. Um, okay, first, hi, here's my phone. Here's my phone. Uh oh, let me take it off.、Rah. Yeah, see, and this is my cell phone. It's black, but the logo, the logo here is white. And oh, that's a pen. There's a pen. So you may say there is a pen. There is a blue pen. There is a blue pen. And one more thing here. Oh, there is a wallet. This is my wallet. And this wallet is brown. It's not black. Okay, you see that? It's a brown one. So there is a brown wallet. And let me see something around me. Oh, 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 oh! One more thing here. Oh, I got a book. There is a red book. There is a red book. And I also have some other books. Bang 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 bang. And there is a yellow book, or sometimes it's orange book, right? So find things around you and describe them. I give you ten seconds to finish it. 十秒时间
Come on, come on, describe things around you with different colors here. Okay, are you ready? Okay, finish? Good, thank you. So this is the first part we'll learn. Use different colors to describe people or things around you. And just now we learned how to use colors to describe things around you. For example, the teacher here, Aaron, has got black hair, black glasses, um, gray shirt, and with a red logo on it. So let's move to the next part. Write words from the box in the spaces here. And then listen, check, and repeat. And you may take that to your book. And it's also on your book, page 44 here. You may see a body here, the parts of the body. So let's remember them here. And this is a boy. And we'll learn different parts of the body. And do you know different parts here? Uh, let's count. Oh, there are 12 parts. Uh, one, two, three, four, a five, and six, and seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. I gave you some time to finish this part on your book. Okay, so turn to page 44 and write the words from the box here. Hand, leg, finger, arm, foot, thumb, mouth, ear, nose, face, hair, and eye. Please write the words in the spaces from 1 to 12. Now, you have got one minute. 给大家一分钟的时间，请你完成这个小横线的填写，请你将这些答案填写到这些横线上边去。请问这一到十二横线上面到底应该填什么名字嘞？ Okay, you have one minute to finish this part. Come on, do it! But here I only got ten seconds for you. 因为往下录课时间，所以曹老师这里只给十秒时间，所以十秒钟之后，曹老师要说答案了，请各位暂停视频一下下。一分钟时间来玩这个图片 Got it? 明白了吗? OK, come on! 10 seconds! OK! Bang bang! Time's up! So now I will show you the keys. OK? Have you finished? 知道了吗? 再次提醒一下,各位同学一定要是在写完之后再来看这段视频 OK? 再继续看 不要偷看答案, OK, come on. Um, this part, I want you to write the words from the box here. Hand, leg, finger, arm, foot, and so on. And to the different spaces here. So, let's test you. Do you know different parts of the body? For example, this is your head, the nose, eye, ear, face, hair, arm, finger, chest, thumb, <laughs> and leg, and so on. So, let's see the... The key is here. Okay, we start from number one. One. And this is the part, very important part, right? You can walk or run with this part, leg. So one, leg. And next one, two. Also very important part, right? You, with the, we, we can write things with them and eat things, right? Hand. And next one, three. Three. See here, foot. Foot. Four. We have ten fingers here, so four, finger, 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 and then five, five. And this is the very important finger, we call it thumb, so thumb. Okay, stop here. Uh, we have ten fingers here, so do you know how to say different fingers here? We call this one is thumb, okay, 大拇指, thumb, thumb. And how about this one? We call this index finger, index, index, 食指, in, I-N, D-E-X, index finger, okay, read again, index finger, index finger, and this one is in the middle, yeah, it's the middle finger, the middle finger, and this one, sometimes, if we get married, we will wear the ring and this finger, so this is the ring finger, ring finger, and last one is very small, so we call it little finger, little finger. So, let's read them again. Okay, show me your hand, show me your hand. Come on, everyone, show me your hand. Okay, so from this one, the very big one, we call it thumb. 不叫 big finger, 这可不叫大拇指, 不叫 big finger, 叫做 thumb, 咬舌, thumb, thumb. B doesn't pronounce, B, 没有发音, thumb, index finger index finger, 
middle finger, ring finger, little finger. Again, 再来一遍 Thumb, index finger, middle finger, ring finger, and little finger. Okay, 大拇指、食指、中指、无名指和小拇指。小拇指最好记就是 little finger。那么这个，因为我们在结婚的时候会把戒指戴在这个上面，说明已婚，所以这个戒指、这个手。也这个手指也叫做结婚手指，所以叫做戴戒指的 ring finger。那么这个在中间做的 middle finger。So the finger is here. Last time, thumb, thumb, index finger, index finger, middle finger, middle finger, ring finger, ring finger, little finger, little finger. Okay, remember that. So let's keep on. This is number five, the thumb. And next one, number six, of course, the arm, right? Arm. And hair. Eight, of course, face. And number nine, ear. We use it to hear things. And ten, nose. Eleven, ah, mouth. And twelve, eye.、Oh. Okay, so read, listen, and repeat. Come on, let's listen again. Listen. Ready? Go. Unit six, exercise five C. Listen, check. And repeat. One. Leg. Two. Hand. Three. Foot. Four. Finger. Five. Thumb. Six. Arm. Seven. Hair. Eight. Face. Nine. Ear. Ten. Nose. Eleven. Mouth. Twelve. Eye. Okay. Thank you. So read them again from one to twelve. Different parts of the body. Okay. Ready? Let's go. Number one. Leg. 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 So show me your right leg. Come on, come on, come on. Show me your right leg. 伸出你的右脚来。我不说中文了啊。Show me your right leg. Your right leg. Okay, leg, leg. And next one, hand, hand. Okay, show me your left hand. Left hand. Good. And next one, foot, foot. Show me your right foot. Out. Right foot. And、next one, finger, finger. Show me your index finger. Show me your little finger. And show me your thumb, thumb. So next one, thumb, thumb. Next one, arm, arm. Show me your muscle, the boys. 男生们，给我显示你的肌肉们。Arm, yeah. 还有女生们，你的肌肉。Arm, yes. Arm, 胳膊。Arm. Next one, hair, hair. Show me your hair. Yeah, hair, right? And next one, face. Show me your face. And next one, ear. Show me your left ear. Nah, ah, ah. Left ear. And next one, nose. Show me your nose like this. Show me your nose. Nose. Next one, mouth. Blah 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 blah. Mouth. And last one, eye. Eye. Okay. Last time. Read them again. Leg, leg, hand, hand, foot, foot, finger, finger, thumb, thumb, arm, arm, hair, hair, face, face, ear, ear, nose, nose, mouth, mouth, eye, eye. Okay, so much for that. So learn different colors and the different parts. Of the body, and now let's see the vocabulary for D. Write the words in the box in the correct list, and then listen, check, and repeat.、Uh, we have a lot of words here like blonde,、uh, brown, short, red, blue, gray, straight, curly, fair, wavy, and medium length, green, and black, and long. We use these words to describe people. Uh, we start from number one, blonde. This is、uh, has been deleted. 
画个小横线，说明这个词已经被选走了。比如说 brown 这个词被选走了 ，straight 这个词也被选走了，还有就是 brown 这个词选，这是我们的 examples， 这是在示例当中。所以示例给出的三个小词已经被选走了。那么这个小示例就是告诉大家怎么来做这个题目的。Okay, so everyone, please open up your book here on page 44 again. Uh, describing people, 5D. Write the words in the box in the correct list, and then listen, check, and repeat here. For example, hair color here, hair color. So there are many, many words here, but I want you to find words for hair color. 上面 n 多的单词，你要选出哪些单词可以来描述头发颜色的？哪些单词可以来描述头发的发型的？还有哪些单词可以来描述眼睛的颜颜色 ？Right. So here. We never say blonde eye, right? We 没有说金眼睛的吧？你有见过长得金色眼睛的人吗？呃、uh, ，that's terrible, right? But we can say blonde hair. 但是有金色头发吧 ，right? Uh, can I say green hair? 你见过有绿发吗？那个有点像绿毛龟 ，right? 当然你别跟我较真说，老师，我我见过有人染发染成绿色。But I mean, I mean the natural hair color. 其实我们说的是自然的头发的颜色。其实我们人类哈，不管是东方人、西方人、外国人还是中国人，一般很少有人长出绿色头发的啊，那是绿毛龟。所以大家在染头发的时候也别染这色。Okay, okay. So, uh, give some time to work out. Uh, choose the words here and put the words in hair color, hair style, and eye color. Okay, let's read them again. Blonde, brown, short, red, blue, gray, straight, curly, fair, wavy. Medium length, green, black, and long. Okay, I give you one minute to think about the words here. And here, I give it ten seconds. Okay, come on, think about it. Dang 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 dang, dang 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 dang.